Welcome to Minlian's RGB Network Effects Controller User Guide Number 3, Effects Player and Light Show Mode. Table of Contents, NEC User Guides, Effects Player Mode, Maximizing Memories, Custom Colors, Linear Effects, Time and Show, Saving Changes, Light Show Mode, Power on Default, Adding Music to the Light Show, Using Timers, questions and resources. The NEC. The network effects controller is Minlion's high channel count professional RGB pixel controller. This tutorial is one of a series of tutorials on the device. For a comprehensive knowledge on the NEC's capabilities, please check out the following user guides published in 2016 and look for others to come in early 2017. The built-in effects. NEC version 1.62, released in the summer of 2016, has 26 built-in effects. Most NEC effects were developed to display in two-dimensional grid designs, incorporating mainly on smart tees. Given the desire to use the NEC in perimeter lighting jobs, four effects have been carried over from Minlion's Wi-Fi effects controller, expander, ping pong, shift, and waves. Refer to the chart at the left. Three memory slots allow us to save built-in effects with different variations. To access the built-in effects, power a configured NEC and set the operating mode to Effects Player. Scroll to and select Effect. The effects are listed alphabetically by scrolling the dial. The effects are followed by three memory slots. Return to the main menu between effect number one, which is bands, and memory three. Effect variations. Effects can be varied in the following ways by selecting the push to edit option under each effect menu. Speed, palette, trails, length, amount, color, and distance. Keep in mind that each effect will have different editing options unique to that effect. Not all the effects will have the options listed above. Palette options include saturated, pastels, white, scrolling color wheel, and random. To set the color, use the, the numerical values 0 through 255. Speed and trails can be assigned a value between 0 and 100. Please note, overall effect intensity control is located in the effects player setup menu. Custom colors. Certain effects you can alter the colors and set them into light show mode but you can't select a static three colors with the NEC as you can do with our other controllers. Effects you can select a custom color, bars, cane, flashes, glow, one color, snow, and waves. Set holiday score team colors to these effects and see how they turn out. And also reference the NEC color value chart on the left side of this page. Linear effects. The NEC's built-in effects were meant to look most appealing on two-dimensional grid-like light designs. But if desired, the NEC can be used in a linear design such as perimeter lighting. And such designs start with the following effects. Bars, cane, color change, color swirl, expander, flashes, glow, ping pong, one color, shift, two color, and waves. Memory settings. Three memory slots allow you to store the same effect with different variations. Memory slots are accessed after the final built-in effect, which is Christmas, or by scrolling backwards from the first effect, bands. In the following example, we can save four different versions of cane to incorporate into a light show. First, set the cane effect with the color green. Scroll to and select copy to memory, memory one. Then save a cane effect with yellow. Scroll to and select copy to memory, memory two. Then set a third cane effect to blue. Scroll to and select copy to memory, memory three. Finally, set the cane effect to the color red, but do not copy to memory. Scroll to save changes and select that. The three memory effects can then be included into a light show with your red cane effect. Pro tip, use this strategy to vary the speed, trails, or palette in addition to the color of the same effect in your light show. Time in show. 
An important effect variable is time and show. After your effect variables are set, decide which effects you would like to play in your light show and for how long. 30 seconds is the default setting for each effect. To exclude an effect from the light show, select not in show located before the one second value on the scroll wheel. All other effects will play for the amount of time set in this field. Choose from all 26 effects plus the three extras we set to memory. Saving changes. Please be sure to save changes every so often and especially after editing your effects. Scroll to the very end of the effects list and just before the effect bands and select main menu push to go back. Scroll from here until you find save changes. Push to select. The NEC version number will appear on the screen to confirm this action. Light show mode. Select light show mode from the operating menu. Scroll to and select ordered or shuffle. Ordered will play effects alphabetically as listed in the effects menu. Shuffled will play at random. Light show power on default. First select light show from the NEC's main menu. Scroll to and select save changes. Recycle power to the NEC. Then the light show will play automatically. Pro tip, to have a single effect power on default and remain set to that effect, scroll to and select power on default in that effects menu, and then save changes in the effect player mode, not light show mode. Adding music. The NEC has a built-in wave player and three and a half millimeter audio jack to play music. Light designers can program their show to music and less technical installers can simply play background music along with the effects. Note, audio files must be in a .wav format saved as 16-bit stereo data at sample rates of 32 kilohertz, 44.1 kilohertz, or 48 kilohertz. First format your SD card, then label the music file one .wav. Copy onto the SD card, insert into the NEC, then play the light show mode and the music will start up automatically. Employing timers. Time menu. The NEC's built-in timer starts and stops light show and effects player modes automatically. From the menu of the mode you plan to use, scroll to and select time. Set the current time in 24 hour format, then set the on time and the off time. Set both the on and off times to zero to disable the timer. Note, the NEC has an internal clock, but it is not battery backed up and will reset to zero after a power failure or when the NEC is unplugged. If using this feature, it is recommended to have a battery backup or simply integrate a third party timer. Pro tip, if using third party timers, be sure to power the NDBs and network switches before the NEC. If the NDBs are powered after the NEC, they may miss out on the data commands and remain dark or out of sync with the NEC. Questions and resources. Please email Reggie at minleonusa.com and reference this presentation. We encourage you to view these related tutorials. The NEC overview, the NDB user guide, our network configuration guide, DMX triggering the NEC, and power and data management. Thank you for your interest in Minleon RGBs.